So here's September's projects. I'm going to kind of just run through them and you're going to get a quick feel for how incentifying is quickly incorporated into projects. We reveal the available incentives and we can also help fulfill the applications to capture those incentives. Um, and they can be pretty lucrative for a lot of these owners. So last month we had uh, hotels. We could not get enough uh, feedback about uh, you guys wanting to see hotels. So specifically notice we had a hotel upgrade uh, in Maryland. Um, you can see the square footage there. And then folks wanted to see a new construction uh, hotel. So we chose one in, in Missouri. Um, you're going to see here in a second, we've got a three-step process. Incredibly intuitive. It goes pretty quickly. Um, everything starts with step one. It's search. If you want to search our database, you being maybe you're the developer on the line, the owner, or you're someone representing them, uh, like I said, the architect, the engineer, general contractor, you name it, um, you fill out the two-minute survey about the property. So it should be someone who's pretty knowledgeable about the property. Um, it doesn't take more than two minutes. It's the minimum amount of questions in Cenefine's database needs in order to advance you to the next step, which is called verify. This is where we verify the eligibility of incentives. You're going to hear a lot of Captain Obvious uh, nomenclature at Incentifying. We like to keep things pretty simple, right? Um, so uh, the owners will always purchase the verify reports. Um, I'll talk about the pricing on that, uh, how that works. But once the verify report is purchased, um, our team of uh, commercial sector incentive experts We'll sit down with the owner or owner's representative and talk about how the, they, uh, the property is eligible for a certain number of incentives. So you can see here the hotel was in a very lucrative incentive offering. Uh, however, based on the two minute survey response, they were really only eligible for about 21 incentives. And even then, they only considered eight incentives. Why would an owner want to consider less incentives and not go after all 21? Well, with the purchase of a Verify report, you're going to get the opportunity to book a one-hour call with our commercial incentive uh, experts. And trust me, you're going to want to do that. Even the folks that have used us dozens of times will always book that call. And it's because our experts will tell you the good, the bad, the ugly on incentives. So while you might be eligible for an incentive, there could be additional costs. There could, it could not really fit your construction timeline. Um, there might be a, a low success rate associated with that. So we will help you really go after the incentives that make sense for your project or your owner's project. So let's have a look at what eight cent incentives represented on this uh, existing hotel in Maryland. Notice they represented $105,000 in cash reimbursements uh, for HVAC, F um, VFDs, LEDs, that's a tongue twister, food service refrigeration, and custom. All that means is perhaps there's not an incentive for a specific focus like you're seeing here. So it's going to capture anything else that's remaining on the energy efficiency front, right? Uh, you can see there was also $10,000 um, cash reimbursement for solar plus tax-related incentives. Uh, for solar there.